Hello, Dr. Harsh. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Some people are surprised to be greeting a longtime high profile Stanford University neurosurgeon in these Sacramento rooms. Dr. Griffith Harsh says he's making this late career move to head up neurological surgery here because of the global reputation of UC Davis Health. That's what one thing that makes it so uh, interesting, exciting, is uh, one gets to be at the frontier of scientific discovery, trying to apply that uh, for the benefit of, uh, of the patient and then passing that on to the next generation of, uh, of neurosurgeons. As an expert in brain tumors, Dr. Harsh plans to focus his leadership in three main areas, including using electrodes in the brain to treat a huge range of conditions. It's been popularized uh, in the treatment of Parkinsonian disease, uh, but also being applied to familial tremor uh, and uh, depression, even obesity. He will also continue his work in groundbreaking developments in radiation therapy and his research into what's called immunotherapy. Using the body's own uh, defense mechanisms to attack uh, uh, tumors within the brain. He brings a lot of experience to that work. A Rhodes Scholar and Harvard grad, he has more than 200 scientific publications, and he'll continue to work as a surgeon two days a week. Dr. Harsh and his wife first tried to move to Sacramento eight years ago. So how great is this morning? Woo! His wife is Meg Whitman, the 2010 Republican nominee you for know, governor who ultimately lost to Jerry Brown. Do you see yourself as political at all? No. <laughs> But he is interested in his wife's business expertise, which has earned them more than $3 billion, according to Forbes. She's the former CEO who made eBay a success, and she just recently stepped down as the CEO of Hewlett Packard. You can expect her husband will tap her for advice as he navigates the management part of his job. I think she's emphasized the importance of uh, hiring the right people at the right time for the right job and being supportive of them of uh, marshalling resources, of uh, setting an agenda and getting things done. Uh, she's operationally superb and I've uh, learned a lot simply by watching her over the years. You may be surprised at what started this move to Sacramento. Harsh and Whitman were considering investing in Sac Republic FC to help Sacramento land a major league soccer team. That didn't work out, but it did give UC Davis Health the idea to reach out to him. Uh, I remain a big, big fan of, um, uh, of the Republic and a member of the Brigade, so looking forward to attending those games. The couple may also get involved as philanthropists. Together, they have created a multi-million dollar charitable foundation. Well, our um, interests overlap with uh, many of the uh, needs and interests of uh, Sacramento. We're, uh, involved in um, uh, preservation of the environment as well as uh, uh, K through 12 education. And they're invested as residents. They have already bought a home in the downtown area. As you're moving to Sacramento, what are your first impressions? The first impression really is the friendliness of the people. Uh, they're so warm and welcoming and, and, and natural.